was a chilly and breezy afternoon today, but plenty of sunshine and highs today were seasonable right around 40 degrees in most areas. Let's take a look outside right now, though, down in New Bedford, where Temperatures are starting to drop now as we head towards the overnight, but we'll stay nice and clear as we head towards the start of your day on Sunday. But temperatures will be frigid, especially during the early morning hours between right around 6 and 8 o'clock tomorrow morning. Temperatures right now in the low 30s across most of the area, 34 in Providence, Coventry right now a little bit colder at 29 down at the coast, Newport also at 34. So we're looking at those very cold conditions, as I mentioned, overnight tonight. We'll be seeing those temperatures drop well into the teens across the area as we head towards the start of your day on Sunday. That'll lead way to a chilly day on Sunday with afternoon highs only reaching really the mid 30s. But we are looking at much milder weather ahead, especially as we head towards the midweek next week with temperatures approaching 50. So some changes on the way, but we have some chilly temperatures to get through first. So let's take a look at those wind chills as we head towards the start of your day on Sunday. Here's seven o'clock in the morning. We're seeing those wind chills right around 10 degrees or less less in certain spots. If you are heading out on the earlier side, uh, be aware that it is going to feel very frigid as you step out the door. Those wind chills will start to moderate though as we head towards the afternoon. Let's take a look at that temperature trend. So after one more day of the chillier temperatures tomorrow on Sunday, we'll be looking at much milder weather as we head towards Wednesday with temperatures possibly approaching 60 degrees. We are tracking some rain and wind associated with some of these milder temperatures, especially on Wednesday. But nevertheless, it'll be a lot warmer out there in the coming days after tomorrow. Satellite and radar clear right now. We may see some light cloud coverage at, at times overnight tonight, but overall with a strong high pressure in place moving through overnight tonight through Sunday we will be staying dry in our immediate area for uh, all of the day tomorrow, although we are tracking the chance for some early morning showers on Monday. Let's take a look at kind of that extended outlook here. So overnight tonight, cold start. It's going to be sunny throughout the day tomorrow. So even though it's a little bit chilly, plenty of sunshine, nice weather. Clouds will start to build overnight Sunday. And here's kind of a week what we call short wave trough moving through the area, which could bring some showers through Monday morning before conditions improve by Monday afternoon. Your Sunday morning here starting off frigid. We will warm up to the 30s, but it's going to be a cold morning. We'll finally settle into kind of the mid 30s for those afternoon highs by around one or two o'clock tomorrow. And for your seven day forecast again, one more kind of chilly day to get through tomorrow on Sunday. But then we're going to be looking at much milder temperatures ahead starting on Monday. Uh, but as we head towards the midweek, some of those temperatures are going to be associated with some rain. But overall, I'd rather see those 50s on the seven day than 30s. So it's certainly a good balance. Yes, definitely. All right. Thanks so much. Now in sports, still perfect. The Rhode Island.